What is going on guys? Elite Chris here and today I am back for another Farming Simulator 2017 Mod Spotlight. Today we're going to be taking a look at this mess I have right here which is the uh, the uh, larger pallet stack. Uh, I don't know exactly what it's called but it's. Uh, I did not do this, trust me. You can buy them like this with a stack of four, a stack of two, or just the stack of one which is the standard one obviously not part of the mod but uh, they have it for everything including the pig feed and the fertilizer is somewhere I know they have it I don't think I have it bought yet but I will show you in a second the liquid fertilizer only comes in a stack of three um, you do need some pretty serious uh, machinery to uh, pick up the big stack of four of the seeds or the fertilizer or the pig feed or the three stack this is the heaviest the uh, three stack of uh, fertili liquid fertilizer from my experimenting you can see all the the equipment I have here just kinda give you a quick overview of it here in a second but uh, first we're gonna look at where it is in the store and uh, before I get to that actually I just wanted to show you these I'll, this is a separate mod I'm gonna I'll put this link in the description as well this is pig feed these two bags right here as you can see you can pick them up and they are uh, functional you can uh, dump them into a tipper or uh, into a cedar or anything like that um, yeah I can show you that in a second as well but uh, yeah that's the fertilizer two fertilizers these are the seeds pretty cool that mod also comes with a truck that you uh, do need to haul them because as I will show you right now so obviously they do not dump by hand so uh, you would have to drive the cedar up to them and then hit R to refill or whatever it is depending on what system you're on or what your bindings are or anything like that so I was wrong about that I do apologize but uh, anyways, we will get into the rest of the video, and maybe at the end, if I remember, I will get back to them. I just wanted to show you these on a side note because these are really cool. If you want to see uh, more stuff about these, I can uh, make another video on them, but there will be a link to download them and these as well. But uh, without me blabbering on anymore about that, we are going to look at where it is in the shop. Obviously, it will be under pallets just gonna scroll all the way past the end and as you can see right here is the uh, if you can read that language then you would know what that is but uh, don't worry if you're like me and you can't uh, read what that is you can either look at the pictures or just look down here it says fertilizer this is your seeds and this is your pig food you can also tell by the picture right here if you're good with the emblems in the game you would know but me I just like uh, reading the obvious which is right there so we're going to move past these and as you can see right here is the seed bag times two times four the solid fertilizer times two I don't have the solid fertilizer times four so I'll buy that I think I kind of messed up something while I was testing and it just kind of dumped it into a tipper and I sold the tipper and the uh, fertilizer was gone so with that being said that is all the buying options it really comes in handy if you don't want to use the uh, auto refill tanks the uh, other mod I did do a mod spotlight on that if you want to check that out not self-promoting in any way but uh, now we're gonna look at a uh, really quick just uh, what uh, what exactly you need to pick some of these up um, if you read the description of the mod not the actual thing I'm just buying a uh, trailer to stick these on real quick We'll just buy, I have a lot, yes. I like the Marshall because it uh, doesn't have the steering in the front, makes it a little easier to uh, handle. So we'll just pick up the Marshall. And also you can change the colors of it, which is uh, pretty cool. So now I'm going to show you uh, the equipment I have here. I have this because this is kind of the uh, one you start with on this map. So this actually can haul pretty much everything if you have as you can see this monster front or this monster weight on it this does not have the uh, wheel weights I didn't think there is a mod that actually has the uh, 
has the uh, wheel weights on it. Sorry about that. I was just adjusting the time. Uh, but without the uh, weight on the back, you cannot really. Uh, you can lift up the bag of two, but uh, for the. Uh, or not the bag, the uh, stack of two, but for these larger. This is pretty much what I tested on because this is the heaviest from what I found out. Besides my really bad pallet fork driving. I'll try to lift this up. There we go. That was perfect. You can see you can uh, lift it up and drive it around good enough to load it. I would not recommend driving far distances with this. But as you can see, you can kind of actually hop out real quick put that on so I can uh, so I can see if something I did not test if the uh, strap goes high enough to go over all of them there is that now uh, we'll hop out and we'll find out together if this actually works yes it does there we go it uh, goes about that high at least Obviously the game was not designed, or these straps were not designed to handle a stack of three of these, which it is pretty massive. There we go, we're on the top. So you can see, if you are afraid of heights, you definitely wouldn't want to do this in real life. But uh, that's why it's not real life, because uh, we can do stuff we normally couldn't. Anyways, that is that. You can use this. The, uh, the one thing you cannot use, sadly, is that thing. I mean... I don't know if it's really sadly, because I don't know how many people actually use it, but uh, it does not have enough uh, horses in the trunk, if you know what I mean, to uh, pick up uh, these bigger stacks. It can do the stack of four, I do believe, of this, but it cannot do the stack of three of the liquid. Um, we will uh, we could test that really quick. Uh, let's see. We'll... Uh We'll just go for that stack of four fertilizers since it's nice and neat over here. This mod definitely, definitely is uh, pretty handy. I mean, and it's not too unrealistic. All right, so there we go. You can see it's uh, kind of like uh, jerking around and the tires look like they're starting to lift up. And this is tension that's not really there. Looks like it's uh, lifted pretty and you don't want to make fast movements like that, but it looks like it could handle it. I'll just kind of take it. Oh, that's uh, that's weird. Definitely wouldn't be able to do that in real life. Pretty sure all of them would uh, come flying down. So it does look like you can manage it a little bit. Again, I would not recommend using this. So if you're just starting the game, I would recommend not probably not buying the stack of four. I just wanted to test this out to see if it actually drains all the bags. In here, it looks like it does. So again, that's kind of handy. If you have a conveyor belt, you can use a conveyor belt. So yeah, that's the other thing I wanted to test. I didn't get the test. I'll just let that. Oh, there it goes. Plus, I'll just let it go because it was taking forever. But right as I said that, it finished. And now my bearings are all messed up. I'm kind of confused here. Confused myself. Obviously, the wheel loader can uh, pick up everything. Me, personally, I do not like to use the wheel loader for uh, pallet fork because with the uh, steering in the front, how it is, you know what I'm talking about, it uh, makes it kind of tough to uh, line up the uh, forks into the spot where they go. So I personally don't use them. The skid steers, this one can handle only the one and two two stack uh, this one can handle everything but the uh, three stack of fertilizer same goes for this one I actually didn't test it on the stack of three fertilizer it works for everything and we're gonna find out right now if it works for the stack of three probably saying you probably should have tested all these before I made the video and you're probably right, but uh, why can't we uh, just experiment together? Probably because I am a horrible, horrible. Alright, so it looks like it can handle these. Which I would have uh, probably guessed it could have. I guess it's 
A little jumpy. Be scared if I was driving this in real life, probably. But in the game, as you know, it probably will work just fine. And these are the other two examples I just wanted to tell you that uh, they both do work, but they both actually needed a weight on the back. This one has the wheel weights. Just with the wheel weights, it actually couldn't handle the stack of three still with just the wheel weights. I had to put an actual weight on the back with the wheel weights. This is not the uh, 2400. This is the 2300 kilogram. This one is the big one on the... This is the biggest... Uh, horsepower-wise tractor that you can put a front loader bracket on. So I just tested it with this, same thing. It doesn't have a wheel weight option in the back, but uh, without the weight, this is the heaviest weight. I did show that a second ago, but in case you didn't catch it. Without this weight, it could not lift up the stack of three fertilizer. So if you're going to use the uh, stack of three liquid fertilizer, um, it can pick it up. I mean, it can, but it's uh, not uh, recommended just like the tractor at the beginning, but it can be done. It just, uh, yeah, I would probably go with a telehandler or the front loader if you want. Me personally, again, I wouldn't. But if you want to, that's totally up to you. And this is the Fent 700. Um, it, uh, the same way, struggles a little bit. Just keep in mind that you do need a back weight, not a back weight, a weight. I keep saying a back weight and I'm going to, uh, yell at myself after the video for saying that. Anyways, that's it guys. I hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you guys in the next Spotlight video or whatever else video you decide to watch mine. I will see you in that one probably. Maybe not. Who knows? Anyways, see you later guys.